Okay, so now let's move to the next command. We have alter table and that you could use it in order to change the definition of a table. So let's say, okay, we need to add one more column to our new table persons and that is the emails. So in order to do that, it's pretty simple. So we could use, I'm going to remove this. We could use the keyword alter table and the table name persons. And after that, we're going to add the keyword add. Now we are adding a new column. It's like in the create table. So we need the column name and that is email. Then after that, we need to define the data type. It's going to be varchar. 15 as well as rule and here as well we need to add some constraints if you want for some data quality you say okay this is not null so with that i'm changing now the already existing table that's called persons and i'm adding now a new column so let's run this and let's check again our table refresh let's select the table persons And see the results and as you can see at the end we have a new column and always SQL gonna add the new columns at the ends so if I check this as well describe persons just to make sure that everything is fine we can see here we have one more column that's called emails var character 15 and this should not be in null all right so that's all about how to alter a table and now we are going to learn how to drop a table it's really easy and in the video description you will find a link to free sql materials like the database and the data of this tutorial the sql sheet sheet and as well all the presentations thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next tutorial bye